There was extra security at Methuen High School this morning after a stabbing that ended with one student in custody and a former student in the hospital. WBC's Katrina Kincaid spoke with parents who are concerned about their children's safety. They saw a kid go out in a stretcher, but they had covered him in a sheet, which to those kids was very scary because they just assumed that somebody died. Back to school the day after a terrifying situation at Methuen High. I know a lot of us like texted our parents right away and we're like, we love you. After an incident where Methuen police say a student stabbed another kid, only stopped from more potential violence after a staff member tackled him, students at Methuen High School will see an increased number of police officers for the next week. I'm a little comfortable with it. I still don't think, I, I mean, I still don't think it's going to help, to be honest with you. The teen who was stabbed was a former student who wanted to confront the suspect and had been led into the building by current students through a side door. Now, the day after, parents are wondering what can be done to stop this. How do you get, how do you bring a knife into school? They don't check backpacks. There's no metal detectors, like there's no way to know what these kids are bringing in or who they're letting in the school. The teen who was stabbed went to Children's Hospital with non-life-threatening injuries and he may be charged with trespassing. I thought it was pretty weird. I thought it would never happen, especially like at the school. Police are still determining how that 16-year-old suspect got the knife into the school. He faces a long list of charges and is being held on $250,000 bail. He will be arraigned today. In Methuen, Katrina Kincaid, WBZ News.